hi guys welcome to another interesting news the indigenous people of biafra have said that no amount of blackmail and propaganda by the nigerian government can change is resolved to actualize its dreams of a biafran nation the spokesperson for the separatist organization ima powerful in a statement on sunday said the indigenous people of biafra would not back out of its commitments to achieve a separate a separate Biafra nation. The Indigenous people of Biafra stressed this as part of its reaction to a report by the Anambra State Police Command that its operative neutralized five members of the Eastern Security Network ESN, the military wing of the Indigenous people of Biafra. Describing the police claims that its operative killed the Indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP and ESN operative as uttered garbage and falsehood. Ima Powerful said the police cannot confront its military wing without receiving the heat, noting that they are not people who can be easily killed. He said, We, the global family of the movement of the indigenous people of Biafra, under the command of under the command and leadership of our great leader Mazi Inamdekanu Okechuku, a prisoner of conscience unequivocally refute the concocted lies and falsehood which the Nigerian government and its security agencies are peddling to the effect that the criminals and kidnappers with whom the Nigerian Department of State Services DSS and the police command have it had to have been working together whom they have now eliminated to cover their evil tracks in Anambra State or operative of the Eastern Security Network and the indigenous people of Biafra members. That claim is nothing but the usual lie and propaganda against the indigenous people of Biafra and the Eastern Security Network being propagated by a morally bankrupt and shameless Nigerian security apparatus to discredit our genuine struggle for self-determination in the international community. The criminal gang led by Udumodu, who murdered by the Nigerian, who was murdered by the Nigerian security agent recently in Anambra State were not indigenous people of Biafra members nor the Eastern Security Network operatives. In fact, the, mod- the murdered criminals were among the names that one of our leaders, Maazi Shinansa Uwori, publicly announced as among the criminals who is in collaboration with the Nigerian Department of State Services DSS were being used to impersonate the Eastern Security Network op- operative by tormenting our people during one of his Radio Biafra broadcasts last month. It is on that very broadcast that he declared them wanted and promised a reward for anyone who can give tips on how to arrest and detain them. By this action, the indigenous people of Biafra made it clear to all the all, to all and sundry that these criminals are not the Eastern Security Network operative or the indigenous people of Biafra members and to prevent these criminals falling into the hands of our gallant ESN operative, the Nigerian DSS and police had set them up for elimination. The statement added that the Nigerian security agencies must understand that the Eastern Security Network are not rich for us that can be killed by anyone without the security agencies losing on the battlefield. The indigenous people of Biafra spokesman stated that the global family of the indigenous people of Biafra was not surprised that the Nigerian government and its security agencies were feeding the public with falsehood, noting that the indigenous people of Biafra had become their worst nightmare. The news that the police command had gone down indigenous people of Biafra members and recovered rocket launchers and AK-47 rifles are all garbage, false and laughable because the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP and the Eastern Security Network operative don't indulge, indulge in criminalities or enforce non-existent sitting at home orders. Everyone should go back and listen to the video where the agent called those guys criminals. Below are the names of the criminals operating between Anambra and Imo State who are already on the indigenous people of Biafra's most wanted list for impersonation. Tempu, aka Butuzo, Kalistus Oshaga, Papando, Oberi Zuma, Sky, 50 Cent, Oberenzi, Uduego, 
Ojimiri, Ifanyi, Agama, and Edge. These gang members carrying out criminal activities between Anambra and Imo State are not indigenous people of Biafra members nor the Insta Security Network operative. Powerful further described indigenous people of Biafra as an upright organization that cannot be involved in any criminalities in Biafra or in Biafra land or anywhere. We can't force unwilling people to support the struggle and neither are we going to kidnap or snatch cars of the same people we are fighting to free from the Nigerian bondage he added. Taking Nigerians' comments, Adamu Usman said, Tribal and regional group, Nigeria don't pass you. Nigeria will rise and work again positively by the special grace of God. Orifo Oneka said, I know this is not the indigenous people of Biafra. Indigenous people of Biafra is a disciplined organization. Chigoze Ude said, Indigenous people of Biafra is now a political organization. They have lost touch of freedom fight. Okochuku said, Okochuku Jude said, You know why Indigenous people of Biafra lack importance and weight? They don't take responsibilities. Peter Om Om Omar said, Don't mind Nigerian police. Small time, they will mention the Indigenous people of Biafra's name. Chiadi said, Omar showed they dissociated themselves from the alleged members killed by the Nigerian terrorists in uniform police seized rocket launchers under indigenous people of Biafra reporters. Inam Dokiki said, Why are the police always trying to blackmail a peaceful movement like the indigenous people of Biafra? Why Fulani terrorists are walking freely all over Nigeria and slaughtering innocent people as they want? Shame to Nigerian police and Nigerian security operative. At large, they are a disgrace to security agencies, terrorists in uniform. Bangida Ibrahim said, We will only take them seriously when they dissociate themselves with Kono and Simon the terrorist. And Oluko Oluako Ugunshala said, That's who they are. They are gradually destroying their land, sitting at home on weekdays to, to destroy their businesses killing innocent people in the name of unknown gunmen but are interested in another man's land, calling it a no man's land, trying to destroy their host environment, children of eight ingrates. You will know them by their wailing and lamenting. G. Paul said, the evil zoo is tirelessly looking for evil reports to tarnish the name of God's children. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button and let us know your opinion and your thoughts via the comment section below and I will see you on the next news. Bye for now.